Hey, Earth Signs. Thank you so much for tuning in. All right, y'all. Hold on. I'm going to get my music going. I should have been started this. But how about that? I'm going to ready to pull some energy for you guys. I'm going to start with the Archangel Power Tarot cards. Okay, so um, don't forget, flip your roles. Take what you need. Leave what you don't need. Use the spirit of discernment. Never force the message to fit. If you're triggered, face your mirror, not in my comment section. Okay, um, these are collective messages. And of course, they are for entertainment purposes only. If you want your own personal reading, you can go to my website. It's in my bio of my TikTok, okay? I am running a special. So you can get one question, $5, two questions, $8, three questions, $12. All you got to do is send me a cash app and make sure you leave your email, okay? So let's see what's up. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, my true guides. Ooh, Ten of Ariel. Bam, Earth Signs. That's the Ten of Pentacles in traditional um, tarot. It's going straight to the point here, okay? So when it comes down to your legacy, you will have so much to be grateful for. Let me look up to the area. Financial success and the promise of retirement, a rich and rewarding family life, okay? So, Tina area. Nine and ten. It says, now you have it all. There is so very much to be grateful for. You have been financially successful and no longer worry about money. Can you envision that? There is a richness to living and it's all because of how diligently you work to get where you are. Your family life has become one of the greatest blessings in your life. You may define family as your birth family or perhaps you have a chosen family with bonds that are just strong or stronger. There is great love and support around you. You understand what really matters. And from that knowledge comes peace. So Virgo, this is your happily ever after, honeys. Okay, so community, long-term investments, all of that. This is your happily ever after, Virgo. I love doing this. I've been reading for Virgo for the last two, three years, honey. I'm a Virgo too as well. My birthday is 99222 on a timer. And it's been a rough journey. Our transformation has been bittersweet, but honey, we have evolved and we are the empresses and the emperors, okay, of the zodiac signs. Like we doing the damn thing. You made it. If you haven't, if you're not seeing this in your life right now, I definitely um, encourage you to go back, reassess, go within, continue to release, continue to heal, continue to align, okay? Because the universe has a promising future for you, for us all, all right? Like, a lot of us aren't on this timeline, but we have gone through this transformation. We are healed. We are glowing. We are happy. We are shining bright. We are operating in our fullest potential, and we have remembered who the fuck we are. Excuse me, y'all. That's how pumped I am about this. Because I know I'm part of the collective, and I've been there with y'all, Okay. Right, y'all um earth signs okay so i definitely i know i kept saying virgo right so i was definitely speaking to some virgos out here okay um but however yeah nothing happens by mistake but earth signs let me tell you you got tons of ideas the energy is flowing through you right now you may be trying to figure out like how you're going to express it but or turn it into something but I feel like if you take the time to really explore the ideas and, and keep moving forward with it, you're going to see some stuff happen. It's like one of these things where you're literally going to have to have this open mind, okay? You're going to have to be open to anything, okay? It's like you got to have this curious mind. Some of you have may, may have been feeling the urge to paint, okay? 414, do it. That's going to help you. That's going to push you is how I'm hearing it, okay? Um, you're carrying this burden. I got the Ten of Wands in the reverse position. I don't know what this is about. Maybe you're carrying this burden because you may not feel like you can get to this Ten of Pentacles or this Ten of Ariels in your life, okay? Um, you do too much by yourself, too. But that's an earth sign thing. We, we just can't, we can't help it, right? But it's time for you to delegate and kind of share I feel like you're supposed to be kind of like connecting with someone else. I definitely feel um, someone is going to be sent to you, okay? 
And this is divinely guided. This person is going to share the same vision as you. I'm hearing just, you know, kind of remain patient right now. But um, you don't have to carry this heavy weight on your shoulders. And when I just thought of that, I start thinking about this right here. Your shoulder, your uh, trapezium. Okay, so somebody may have been having some issues here. A lot of tension here. A lot of tension in your upper back and your lower back as well. Okay, um, anything else? Yeah, two of pentacles. Yep, you, you are carrying so much responsibility. Five of cups. Things from the past. It's imperative that you literally take care of yourself, okay? And your personal well-being first so that you won't burn out. All right, so if you're feeling an urge to just like rest, do some self-care, you know, go to physical therapy, um, acupuncture or something, go exercise, do it. You got to put your own oxygen mask on first before helping other people, unfortunately, right? But you can't help other people if you are not helping yourself. But otherwise, like these are just tools that are imperative for you to follow because, again, you want to get to your Ten of Pentacles, right? That's the Ten of Ariel, the same card, but it was in a reverse, so those are some of the things that have been blocking you from being able to fully... Um, see this financial success that you've been looking for to see a rich and rewarding family that you've been looking for okay you haven't been taking care of yourself you've been putting everybody else's needs before you okay so um yeah late yeah put the weight down brush it off that's what i just keep hearing just brush it off push it down to the ground take it from the top push it down to the ground okay now um let me see if I can get another card for you guys real quick. Yep, seven of Rathia. Okay. Because it's time to make a decision. You got to be extremely clear about what you want and take action. All right. Some of you may need to detoxify. But otherwise, yeah, it's time for you to make a decision. Because the next step for you is this. You've already at that point where you can just literally sit back and put your feet up. Okay. Because you've done the work. Sit back, put your feet up, and just relax. This is the moment for you to just relax and just coast right on through this, okay? Because the universe is aligning with your frequency and you're attracting this stuff into you, okay? All right, so, yeah. Yeah, I feel I feel real good about this earth signs, all right? So, I definitely love you guys. Don't forget, hit the like button, go over to my YouTube, subscribe. Of course, if you're a Virgo, I do have a um, Be More the Virgo Goddess channel over on YouTube, so please go and subscribe to that. Um, I need at least a thousand followers over there to really get it get it shaking. I'm at seven seventeen. You see that number, y'all? Okay, so definitely help me with that. I definitely appreciate all y'all support. All right, peace out.